Hey guys and girls, it's BB here from myfreeimplants.com. I am doing my one week HOF video blog and um, I've been HOF for one week today. So actually in a couple hours it'll be one week and one day. <laughs> so I decided to do a vlog um, marking that anniversary thing. So. Um, I just wanted to kind of describe uh, my experience as a Hall of Famer. It's been really uh, interesting. Uh, things do change dramatically and um, uh, it's all very, I don't know, you, you're very emotional when you see that you've made HOF and um, for me it was very surprising because it really happened very quickly. Thank you, Scott. And also, Scott, I need to thank you for continuing to support me even after making Hall of Fame. Um, you have continued to uh, help me <laughs> in matters. And thanks for, you know, sticking by me and everything. I appreciate it. Uh, I know it can be a pain in the ass, <laughs> but thank you. And to my other Scott, <laughs> Thank you for helping me um, with all the crazy things that we have going on. Um, and uh, that's for just Scott. <laughs> so, um, anyway, so I hit HOF and um, I did it in just under three months. So, uh, it wasn't like I was on here a long time, and um, it happened really quick, and for that I'm very grateful, um, but it was all like a whirlwind of craziness, and um, the day I hit HOF, I was just chatting, and I had a couple hundred left, and I was chatting, and I refreshed my page, and then all of a sudden, um, there it was, it said, welcome to Hooterville, and you know, you're like, <gasps> what? <laughs> you know, <laughs> you feel all like... I mean, I'm not a crier, so I wasn't like, oh, you know, I wasn't like that. I was like, you know, I had big smiles and lots of excitement and, um, um, you know, and then for the next couple of days, it's like you can't sleep, you just, you're constantly like, oh my god, oh my god, I did it, oh my god, I did it, oh my god, I'm in, I'm in home of AM, I'm getting booms, oh my god. You know, for about two days, you're all just, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And then, <laughs> um, you know, there's a 30-day waiting period. When you hit HOF, you then have 30 days um, where basically you just have to remain active on the site. And um, after 30 days, you get to download your papers, sign them, send them in. And then you wait for however long it takes to get your review done. So it's actually, you know, not an instant overnight like, oh my gosh, I'm Hall of Fame and, you know, next week I'm making my appointment to get a boob job. It's not like that. And understandably so, you know, this website does a lot of great things for us and they just basically have to make sure that, you know, we're true to them as well, so for that I can understand, but still, you're waiting 30 days and you're like, oh my god, oh my god, <laughs> what day is it today? <laughs> um, and you know, I, it's been seven days now, but I would say after the second day I was like, alright, I'm excited, alright, I'm excited. <laughs> Like, I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Is the time yet? What day is it? No, it's only day five. Oh, giddy. <laughs> I still have 25 more days to go. Um, and it's, you know, you get on. I get, I still get on every day. And, um, um, the benefactors, obviously, you know, I don't want to take away from the girls who are still trying to get HOF. At the same time, it slowed down for me as far as chats go. 
Uh, I have my handful of guys who I still chat with on a daily basis, which is great, and I love that. But, you know, you're so used to being like, pop up, pop up, pop up, and, um, you know, the messages, which, you know, for most of, well, for all of my benefactors, all the messages are free now. So I'm like, yeah, you know, talking all the time, everything will be good, and, you know, it's really slowed down a lot, which is fine. I know they're here to support the girls who are, you know, still reaching for that HOF goal. So that's fine. I just, I miss, I miss it. I miss the chatting and I miss the interaction. I miss the friendship and the camaraderie and, you know, um, but like I said, I have the benefactors, my friends that I've made that still, um, chat with me on a daily basis. So I appreciate that. And most of them now have heard me whine. <laughs> about how ready I am um, to get my boobs. Which hopefully, I'm hoping that I can make my um, surgery in June. I'm hoping, my fingers are crossed for June, and then um, I'll be all like healed up. My birthday is July 21st, so my goal is <laughs> to be healed up by my birthday and do the whole like unveiling of the new tatas on my birthday, which would be way cool. Um, so yeah, say goodbye to these things that really are not too impressive right now. <laughs> um, so ladies, you know, that uh, if any of you watch this, it's such an exhilarating, it's almost like an adrenaline rush when you first hit HOF. And then it's the way, and no one really can understand what that does to you until um, until you get there. <laughs> You're sitting on the computer going, um, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, and you just wait. So. I sometimes find myself sitting on my free implants, just staring at the screen, waiting for something exciting to happen. <laughs> so I'm a little obsessive compulsive. But anyway, um, so that's my first week of HOF. I'm just kind of playing the waiting game now and making sure I have all my ducks in a row and um, just kind of enjoying, I guess, because, you know, you kind of enjoy, like, the slowness because I've gotten a chance to finally read, you know, lots of the news things. Like, I always read the ladies when they're in the news, when they have their little questionnaires. I always read those, but now, like, I've been going back and I've been reading, like, the silly little articles that they do and, um, and, like, all the blogs. Like, I really have time to read the, um, benefactor blogs and the ladies blogs. I really have time to go through and read them now where before you know I would try to read them through like chatting and I'm like oh I'm scanning through them but now I actually like have time to read them which is really cool um and a lot of fun and some of the ladies are just absolutely fantastic and you know there's a few of you that I'm really rooting for and some of you are doing really amazingly well and thoughts to that um Congratulations to the new Hall of Famers, and um, congratulations to the girls on the closest to goal list. You are almost there. You got one foot in the door, and it is a great feeling. Wait or no wait, it's an amazing feeling to know that in a couple months, you will have achieved a dream that you've probably had for a long time, like me. So, congratulations, and thank you to my friends. You have been nothing but kind to me, and I will always appreciate that, and I will never ever take that for granted. So thank you guys. I love you. Mwah! This has gone on long enough, if you're still here. Thank you for watching. Bye.